Today we're going to test whether it really matters whether we wear the cuff on the left hand or the right hand when we're taking our blood pressure. So I've got two Omron blood pressure monitors. One is the X4 and the other one is the X3. So the differences between both of them is that the X4 has Bluetooth connectivity, which means that you can connect to an Omron app and upload your data. And this one does not have connectivity at all, which means that you need to find maybe an app or write down the readings that you take. Although it does store um, your readings, but um, there's only a limit to which you can store your readings after which it would start to delete the oldest readings So we're going to put the X4 on my left arm and the X3 on my right arm So we're going to start it So the right arm says 121 over 95 and the left arm says 122 over 91 uh, the pulse is 92 for the right arm and 99 for the left arm so i would say that there is not much of a difference there let's take another reading so the one on the right so it's 127 over 85 and the pulse is 96 and the one on the left says 118 over 88 and the pulse is 97 so there is not much difference again between both of them slight variation with the sister readings but um, the diastole and the pulse are almost the same we'll take another reading So the reading on the right hand says 120 over 85 with a pulse of 100 and on the left hand side it's 110 over 82 over 100. So the difference again is with the systolic reading. So let's take uh, another reading. So almost the same reading again. Um, the huge disparity is between the systolic reading in both. So the conclusion I came to is that it really doesn't matter whether you take your blood pressure reading on the left or the right. Um, it's your choice really. If you wanted to know how to get a good blood pressure reading, click on the next video and thanks for watching.